Redemption, love, heartbreak, betrayal, revenge. Those are just some of the stories that you can find in The Legend of Heroes. It is a tale spanning multiple games, taking place in the continent of Zamiria, and it is my favorite game series. I'm just here because I want more eyes on it, I just want to talk about it. For those that are unaware, this series contains four major arcs, from Sky, to the Crossbell, to the Cold Seal, and currently still being made are the Kuro, or Darkness, Black, whatever it's called, because it hasn't been localized yet. There is a bit of disagreement on how you should, what order you should play the series. And the most obvious that everyone says is, play the games in order. And I mostly have to agree with that, but I actually didn't. I started with the Trails in the Sky series, and I don't regret it. But instead of playing Crossbell next, which is the next arc after Trails in the Sky, I played Cold Steel first. And I would, I would say playing the Cold Steel arc before the Crossbell arc didn't really affect my experience much. In fact, it made me enjoy the Crossbell arc even more. With that being said, with all the buildup that led to the final moments of the Cold Seal arc, I just have to say that I'm glad that I played Trails in the Sky first, and the same with Crossbell. I would still recommend playing Trails in the Sky first at the very least because there's so much potential to otherwise miss out on, but if you can't bring yourself to do that, play Cold Seal first. That is what many say is a great entryway too, but only play the first two games because that's where nothing's really spoiled. Maybe some things here and there, but nothing that'll really affect your experience. The one thing is, you can play the Crossbell arc first, but there is one arc, one character arc that is probably many people's and my, my personal favorite story arc that gets concluded in that game that carries over from the first like Trails in the Sky series. And that's one thing you should know. The story spans every game. Of course, plot threads, story ties, they get they will get tied up depending on the game, but overall there's an overarching story throughout the entire series. Personally, my favorite game is still Trails in the Sky, second chapter. The characters in there, the world, the build-up. Straight masterpiece. There's just so much character development, so much planning so much care that goes into the stories of these games that it is honestly a shame that people who love JRPGs, who love big stories, interconnectedness, it's a shame that they haven't played it yet. Of course this is a big undertaking, there's a lot of games and if you don't have the kind of time, that's understandable, but, but if you're that kind of person looking for a series, a game, anything to just sit down, relax, get into, lose yourself in the world, learn about everything and everyone because it's so captivating. A game with great combat, a great world, you should definitely check out Legend of Heroes. You will not regret it. Because as I said earlier, it is currently my favorite game series. Persona 5 Royal. Now that that is that's my favorite game of all time and I don't think that will ever change. But if I had to pick a favorite series, The Legend of Heroes is definitely number 1. Peace out.